What is going on, people? Welcome back. Johnny here. And it appears using this thing for heat is total shit. Maybe if I just close the door. I guess we could make some heaters. Let's keep an eye on this dead squirrel. Maybe we should just butcher it. All my miners are distracted right now doing a bunch of construction work. Did you fail, you schlub? So this is from the vanilla fences expanded mod, I think. <laughs> Let's see. I can't see mods here. Oh, that's too bad. Anyway, look at the first episode. Pretty sure it's vanilla fences. Vanilla fences expanded something. Either way, it's great. I love these fences. They're super fun. So at some point, I anticipate... Oh, nice. All right, because we're trying to get a royalty victory here. We'll be the sick royal t royalists based off my YouTube name. And this will be our nest. There you go. How much steel are we sitting on? Quite a bit. There's some silver there as well. Which wouldn't be bad to pull that. I'm not used to starting a game with so much stuff. I always, always, always do... Like Naked Brutality. And man, Crash Land, it's a different game. But it just gets you over that hump. Otherwise, the beginning of the game is always kind of the same. It's fun. I like it. But I've done some pretty extreme playthroughs in that regard. If you're watching the Ice Sheet stuff, you know what I'm talking about. So I think we've proved we can do it. Let's just uh, get past that point. Plus, it's nice to start with three pawns that I had some control over. What their stats were. Oh shit, look at this. Get over there. And it is still really hot in here. So I think the issue is the daytime, nighttime temperatures are fluctuating pretty extremely here. Mm, what's the best bet? You know what? To hell with it. Let's go ahead and let the door close. Deconstruct this. Um, if there's any roof out there, go ahead and remove it. I don't care about that. And then let's just put in some ACs. It's fine. Temperature AC. And let's get that tree chopped out. And before too long, we'll need some heaters. We have a fair amount of components right now, so it's fine. In fact, I think I'll just build some heaters right now, too gonna need more power over here there's a decent chance this wall not a decent chance this wall is gonna come down at some point because I don't want a stupid wooden wall but it's okay how are we doing for meals okay we have 18 so it's probably time we started thinking about where we're gonna get food tons of stuff to harvest we can also do a bunch of hunting our squirrel not gonna spoil for a little while yet so that's good So over here, I would say we're going to have a big cooler area, freezer area, butcher table, cook room, all that kind of stuff. Probably don't need this big of a zone on this kind of a map, but that's okay. It's guaranteed food. I wouldn't mind if they finished up that construction sooner rather than later, but I guess they're going to drag their feet on it. It doesn't help that all of our supplies are so far away there's still three of these on the map I'm just leaving them for now because we don't need them I decided security needed to be tantamount you never know how RimWorld is going to go usually early game the times I failed is due to heat stroke <laughs> so with our ACs, if we could get those installed, that'll be avoided. There's some jade right there. Should be able to just plunder this map for resources. So mm, I don't think that'll be a big issue. Oops, someone got nuzzled. That's nice. So she has plant skills. Yeah, she's decent. She's a four. Jeez, walking over these trees. There's your first raid. 
Some bro with a club. Are you attacking immediately? Yes, you are. All right, let's get our crew out. So we didn't finish our security. Oh, shit. One of our bros is way over there. It's Brando. You guys rest, run out and rescue Brando. That's a bit problematic. Like, dude's under the gun now. All right, you have a knife and some armor. This dude is straight up naked, so I think we'll be okay here. You go stand behind that tree. Oh, shit. Keep running, partner. You get down here for the distract. Yo, partner. Give him a stab. Ah, shit, you can't catch him. All right, you guys can't shoot for shit, so just get out of there. Axum's never going to catch that, bro. You guys break... Break right. Ah, oh, we got stuck. There we go. Well, now we're into it. Everybody's wounded. Hopefully he didn't get it too bad. Now just a bruise. Yeah, he shot him in the back twice. Take that, you son of a bitch. He's down. All right, well, you suck. We will take your gear. Mm, that gear is garbage. All right, so misc, grave. Where do we want to put a grave? Somewhere out of the way. We'll get him buried at some point. Make sure we have somebody set to do medical. We do. You should be doing that on a one. Make sure everybody else is set to patient. Everybody is. Who's our doctor? Uh, Brandon is. So let's make sure Brandon is set to self-tend so that he actually takes care of himself. And since we were only bruised there, we're going to go ahead and not use any meds. There you go. All right, everybody as you were. Perfect. Well, things were going really well before I decided to get involved in making security. Where's Brandon? He's tending himself already? Yeah, he did good. And these bruises, they should heal up just fine without any issue. Bruise, not very severe. All right, I want you to go tend that guy sooner rather than later, though. So there you go. Not the best quality, but... All right, give me my dude here, bio. He's an 11 with a passion, so... All right, almost done. This dude still hasn't croaked. I'm not going to take that tribal kilt. It's garbage. Where are you going? Ah, he's out harvesting berries. Hey, nice. More chunks of spacecraft. Two more. That leaves five on the map. Are there any of these anywhere? 127, let's get them all hauled. Because we're going to need food soon. <laughs> so I might just turn... Oh, no. Who's my cook? Cook, cook, Alex. What is Alexander working on? Am I, am I seeing this wrong? Why isn't she doing the butchering? I have no idea. Good thing I saw that before it spoiled, though. All right, she's choosing raw berries. Is she an ascetic? No, she's a gourmand, which is part of the reason our food is disappearing so fast. Let's go ahead and make a stove. I want an electric one. Gonna want some light for that as well. And let's see how the grid's doing. We have tons of power, so that's not a problem. So why was she constructing over butchering is going to be the next issue. I have no idea. We'll have to figure that out. And let's get rid of the... Uh, you know what? Let's, let's do a butcher table. Because we can. There we go. Didn't need two of them. I know it's bad to have these next to each other, but it's short term. You know, one thing we could do is just put the food storage over here. I want that construction done so we can get back to it. Ooh, that guy's croaked. Can we get our grave dug yet? No. Well, that's a problem because he's in a really bad spot. <laughs> All right, do we have any more of these on the map? No. Okay, good. All right, so Alex should be our constructor. You are well-rested. Get your butt up. Now, what are you going to work on next? 
let's get these built. So they prioritize, it looks like, security over other stuff. Which makes sense, right? And then let's go ahead and get a bill in to make simple meals. I love that they just put in the bulk stuff right away. So go ahead and do until we have 10 should be fine. Pause and we get down to 3. We'll use all meat and vegetarian products that we have. And then go ahead and cook a single one. We'll do the same thing. So we want 10 and 3. And I'm trusting she can't make fine meals yet, right? Oh, shit. Why are we making those crappy meals when we could be making fine meals? Usually you don't start off with good cooks. Well, that was a big waste. All right, there you go. We got fine meals. Now, why isn't she doing it? Need material. Okay, we have to go do some hunting. And then the reason I didn't get rid of this sooner is so that we can just copy and paste that bill in there. And then next step, who's got a gun? You two do. Let's go kill something. There's a bunch of pigs over here. Also, there's a bunch of these laying around. There's a dead human over there. We got to deal with that bro at some point. All right, kill that pig. They suck really bad at shooting, so this is going to be problematic. We should be able to kill a few. There's a whole herd of them. If they come chasing after us, we're going to be in trouble. We did manage to kill a few so far. And I think we're going to go for one more. Some of them will probably die from wounds sustained here. <laughs> okay, you guys are so bad. He actually made it up to level one. So they both went up a level in their shooting, so that's good. Hey. That's interesting. That means our zone is full. I think. Why won't you haul? Yeah, there it is. Okay, duh. I just looked at the wrong thing. Okay, there you go. So let's get those guys butchered up. We should have four pigs coming in, and then Alex should get to butchering them straight away. Everybody wants to do some recreation. We never finished our security. We got to bury this schmuck. We have a lot of stuff to do here. You didn't get shot. No, you're just bruised. Everybody else healed up, so it's just that, dude. All right, good. So she's going to do the butchering, then she should cook. There you go. So we'll get fine meals out of that. And it would be nice to have a freezer sooner rather than later. I'd like to put that stuff out over here, but at the minute, how much meat do we get per pig? We have 40 sitting here. Yeah, we need to get those pigs on ice, man. So, what if we... I have, for some reason, I just have this thing that I need everything to be nice and squared off. <laughs> I don't know. It, it, yeah, it's just a thing. I want this to be double-walled. So we can make this our freezer. We're going to need access to it from... The cook side and the butcher side. All right, I should be able to make do with that. Now, if I could just get them mining again. We have to keep a close eye on these pigs. At the very least, we can just butcher them before they go. And our security should be done tomorrow. I need this schmuck to get buried as well, though. This turkey wandered in. If I see it eating our crops, we're going to kill it too. Axum. He's almost fully healed. You can tell because it goes green. All right, perfect. How are we doing for components? We're doing well. Can you chop a tree? Not very fast, but yeah, you can do it. And then we'll clear your prioritized work once the tree's out of there. Is Axum hauling on too high of a priority? No. Good. I would just forget this and start on the mining again, but I think that stuff's pretty high priority. Another thing we're going to need to do here is mine a spot to put our little freezer installations. 
And if we need to, we can put a, another one over here too. All right, she's getting the coolers built. He's getting the coolers built. The heaters are in. Temperatures here should be nice and stable. How are we doing for supplies? We're out of steel. That's a major problem. How's the power grid doing? That's a major problem too. <laughs> uh, do you see any steel? Oh shit, sometimes the game kind of hiccups on you. No, we have no steel. All right. That's because we built traps and we built doors. You're going to bury this dude as soon as you're done with that. There. Now, where to get steel? There's steel over here, but that's quite a ways away. Here. We're not going to mine at all. We just need enough for like... Oh, we're getting that silver, which is very low priority. <laughs> if we get a trader, though, we'll be happy we have it. How's our pork doing? We have about two days to get this freezer done. Oh, wow, that didn't take long. They always send them in twos now, because when there's one, you can easily overwhelm them, and they're worth so much. So they started sending those dudes in twos. Good, this is what I wanted to see right here. So one thing we're going to do is protect the freezers, which means we have to reinstall this somewhere else. Could just put it over there by the door. And that gives us another chunk to break down. So now we have slate, granite, and there should be a little marble here somewhere. There it is, a little bit of marble. We're doing well. These guys better stay outside. I don't want them coming on our traps. If we get raided right now, we poke our head out and shoot that dude and run like hell. All right, over here. She's going to cook some meals. All right, here it is. This is our first quest. Who do we want to be royal? Whom do we want to be royal? I hope they still fish once they're made royalty. That would suck. So they're not going to haul or clean. So let's not use our cleaning hauler, fella. So Axum, you're out. Alex. Works out that she's gay because then... Well, I'm surprised they're not hitting on her regardless of the fact. Anyway, that's a side note. She should still mine if we make her royalty. She is our cook, which is a problem. I think that leaves Brandon. He is social. Yeah, he's our most social person too, so that's the best move. So let's go find that quest again. Quest, accept, Brandon. There you go. Calaris has joined. Check this bro out. He looks like if you were playing chess, like that's the king pawn. Not the king pawn, the king figure in chess. And we have a goose. Does he have a weapon? I could give a throne speech. That dude's Vertilos. All right, let's go see if we can... It's going to die on a trap, but we're short on steel is the problem. So, Where's a goose? There it is. It's chasing after him. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you know, geese, like, they might chase you, but they never... Like, if they bite you... We were in Hawaii not too long back... And we went to one of these like farm sanctuary things and a goose bit my wife and she thought it was funny. Well, there you go. Goose, dead. Yes. No. Come over here and mine, dude. I know we need the freezer done, but we need that done too. So. And can we open length quest? Can we call the ship in? When's the ship going to show up? How do I figure that out? <laughs> there it is. Awesome. We could put this bro to work, but I'm not going to. Where's that shuttle here? We're just going to get rid of him right away. And off you go. Where's our reward? Brandon. Uh, install this, partner. 
Hope you weren't carrying steel. You'd think there'd be steel more nearby. All right, what'd you get from that? I have no idea. Let's see, bio. He got stun level one. All right. But I don't think he gets any stupid needs or anything out of it. So he's a yeoman. Yeoman. I think we're good. We have to be careful and not get him a title that we can't deal with. Last time I tried royalty, that's what happened. How's our hog doing? 19, 20 hours. Hmm, Alex. What happened to our meals? Oh, shit. It says we have 10. Where are they? Why don't I see any meals? Oh, that says we have 10 as well. Oh, they're right there. Durr. All right, well, the meals are going to last several days. So we have enough meat for 10 more, 11 more, actually. So let's just make that 21, pause at 5. Oh, not 1,021, 21, pause at 5. And unpause, unpause. That should get her working on that. And this goose is going to last another 2.3 days. We have all of our security in place. We're getting rice, which is fantastic. And most of the pork will get used up here. And we just need to keep an eye on our meals so they don't spoil. <laughs> I like it. Look at he's cleaning. The place is going to stay so nice. And we should expand our cleaning zone to incorporate this new area that we're working on. Beautiful. What's Brandon doing? He's like, well, you know, since I've been made royalty, I'm just going to sit in my RimWorld shirt. I wish I had some cigarettes to smoke or something. I don't know what royalty do. <laughs> I want you guys to mine over there and over there. Uh, so one thing we were going to do to protect this business is structure granite wall. So we'll get that built. There's that turkey. That's not even our turkey. He'll eventually step on one of our traps if we don't kill him. And then zone, just make sure there's no roof over this. And then this, so this is just going to be a little vent area. We're going to start with two coolers in here. And if we need more, we'll add more later. But we should be okay. I always get these overly ambitious building ideas up front. So... <laughs> And once we have that in place, then we'll work on uh, maybe bedrooms. I'm going to build another bit of this wall right now, just so I don't forget later. All right, Alex got herself closed in. So she's going to be mining. <laughs> That's how you get them to focus on the... Ah, oh, we just lost 36 pork. How's our meals doing? We have three days. How's the goose doing? 1.5 days. Okay, good. All right. Axum's going to free Alex here, which we appreciate, Axum. You're a good bro. Temperatures in here, pretty good. I think we can reinstall this outside now. We do have to get some conduits over to it as well, though, so let's do that. I think it makes heat, and we have coolers going, so we don't want heaters and coolers working against each other. So that should free up a little power on the grid. I want you working over here, Alex. We also need to go get that stone, or stone, that steel taken care of as well. And maybe we start making doors out of wood if they're internal. Alex, you're really chapping my ass. She can't focus for anything, man. I like that he cleans. That's that means I have something set right. Cleaning zone is so good. Otherwise, he'd be cleaning out here, which just really pissed me off. All right, he's going to chill out. We should probably put some lights around as well, but I'm not going to do that for now. We are going to get infested periodically, and it's just part of the game. Hopefully, we don't die. So, wooden doors. 
Boom. Boom. And we need to rework these things. So I think we'll put this over here. Shit. I'm going to need a little more space, I think. <laughs> How many tiles? We have six tiles. Okay. Orders. Do a little mining back over here. There. Yeah, you can work on that for now. 72 in there. So you can see inside it says, well, we sh okay, these doors are closed. But because it's under the mountain, temperatures stay more stable, more tame, all that jazz. This has 24 hours. I'm going to go ahead and butcher it now. And we've killed our light. So let's go ahead and run some conduit to it, which we can't do right now. So we're just going to have to move it over here for now. That's fine. And they're all off to bed once again. Summer is upon us. That's good. We should be able to stockpile a shite ton of rice if summer only just started. So that's great. We should be out. Did anything die over here? I forgot to look. Might be a dead pig laying around. I don't see one. I don't know why, but mountain bases are so freaking fun to me. It's like one of the things I love most about RimWorld. <laughs> Do we have any other meat? No. We're going to have to take our crew out and do some hunting and some mining. Brandon's sleeping in. Get up, dude. He's probably going to want to recreate. Yeah. All right, so let's start by killing the turkey that's in here. You guys stand by each other. Don't get too close to it. Neither you is what could be confused as stealthy. Awesome. One down. Let's go pick on those pigs some more. The deer, that's a good target as well. We should just stock up on meat, but... Oh my god. This is just embarrassing. There we go. We killed one. Alright, it's been a real bloodbath, but we killed them all. I'm tempted since I'm standing here to shoot some turkeys too, but we don't want to end up with too much that we can't deal with. Brandon, you're a real schmutz. Nowhere to put it. Why is he telling me that? That one's reserved by Axum. Will you just not haul anymore? Because of your trait? I don't think that's the case. Ah, here's our issue. This time the zone really is too full. All right, beautiful. So go ahead and haul that in. I like that he still does some basic work for us. I don't like that the game jumps around like that once in a while. <laughs> All right, so there you go. We have critters. I have some meat. We have meals. We're doing all right. So let's focus our mining in here so we can get the next bit of stuff built. We also need to send somebody out to mine over here. We need more steel. So we're going to need two more ACs in here. Both of them will have power. And then we can probably make this even bigger down the road. Look, we can actually get one of them done already. That's great. And shoot, guess what? Now, do I bother making another one of these is the next question. I guess we will. Are you doing the mining? You are. Good. And you're going to have a nice meal while you're out there. We'll get somebody to come pick that up. Uh, you know what? I'm going to have him just do a bunch of this. And I might regret that when he has a mental break, but that's okay. Brandon is getting the rice. So let's go ahead and set our zone up. Why is that? That's because we don't have enough power in the grid. How much does that take? 200. There you go. All right. So zone stockpile. This. Let's make sure our cleaning zone is expanded where it needs to be. Uh, decent, I guess. 
I'm going to go ahead and take care of some of this business right away. We know we're going to want these areas cleaned. That's fine. A little bit of cleaning outside, I guess, is okay. But Okay, that thing's fired up now for whatever that's worth. Did you get that mining done? Probably going to... Oh, okay, good. Somebody else can come grab that. Yeah, steel's going to be a bit of an issue. So then we'll kick this way down. 16 degrees and then clear important foods we don't want to put kibble we don't want hay I guess chocolate can go in there meat vegetarian animal products I don't want insect jelly to end up in there and I don't want packaged survival meals in there there you go Get all that stuff moved. And then, oh man, it's pretty hot outside. I also want animal carcass. Ugh, bloody hell. All right, I turned on carcasses too, so we'll get rid of this zone. These guys moved. Hopefully they're going to last until we can build that one last thing. And there's some disturbed sleep. I guess we don't really need to do the actual cooking room straight away. All right, so orders. You know what we're going to do is, since I don't want to be running power conduit in the room, that'll just have to be deconstructed later. We're really short on steel. We'll just do that. How much steel do we have here? We're going to have to go get more. And we still need... Oh, that's ready to go there. I had hoped we'd run into some steel while we're doing this, but we didn't. <laughs> Would have totally solved all the issues. Where are you headed, buddy? You're going to go get that steel. Is there over 25 there? No. We're going to be four short. And our miners are all tuckered out. She should go back to mining in a minute. Relaxing socially. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't know why somebody isn't building this. It's ready to go. She might be the only one that has skill. What was that thing he just did? Did you see that? Recreation, ate without a table, ate a fine meal. That must be it. All right, and then let's get this one dropped way down to 16. Smoothing floor. Oh, there's a raid on. Interesting. Let's, uh, let's turn off the stove for a minute. See if we can get any extra juice out of the grid. Let's get everybody out. This these raids aren't aren't an issue at all because we have security in place. Staggeringly ugly jogger. The only thing that the only reason we'd go out there, look at this gear. This gear would be fantastic to have. Now she does have a gun. It's gonna is she a good shot? If she's as bad as we are, we're gonna go get her. Okay, let's go get her. <laughs> Mostly so we can end up with her gear. Those thrombos piss off already? Yeah, they did. That's too bad. I'll just shoot the thrombo. Let it kill her and then let it die in her trap. That'd be fantastic. Alright, we should be able to outrange her with the bolt. Oh shit, here she comes. Here she comes. Get behind these rocks quickly. <laughs> She'll probably turn around yet. She's not ready to assault us. Oh, shit. She's not turning around. Who's got the ranged weapon? You get over there. There we go. I was gonna... Okay, this is like a idiot slap fest. There's no sense even doing that. The way these morons are skilled is going to take a billion years before anybody hits anybody. I think we can get cover behind this. Nice work. She does have armor on too, so she shouldn't have range. Yeah, she does. That sucks. Alex, you should be able to outrange her. Yeah. Go stand somewhere where you can actually shoot. Can you shoot from there? You know, maybe we just send this dude over. He's armored up. What could go wrong? She can't see from there. Maybe if you stand over here? Nope. What about there? Holy shit, let's not shoot our own bro. 
All right, all right, no more shooting. You guys really suck. Are you decent at melee? Yeah, you're a three. Not as good as our boy, but you don't have anything that won't do anything other than bruise. Oh, he got a crack in his femur, dude. I think we're just going to punch her so we can get her gear. Beautiful. We'll take that. Better not be gene coded. We will. Shh, wait. Were you you weren't good. You sucked, right? Yeah, staggeringly ugly. I don't want to deal with that. Are you a great miner? You are a great... Oh, no, that's you. <sighs> nah, forget it. I'm only going to try and take relatively decent pawns. All right, so let's get everything carried over. That's a bunch of gear for us. Everybody on draft. See you later, Kaida. Look at her hair. The hairs... In that mod are so great. We don't want these. We don't want these brought over. You telling me nobody could carry that? Can you haul that? You don't have anything else, do you? No. Ah, uh, somebody picked up a chunk. That's what happened. Which is fine, but all right. Let's get all this brought in. There's our dog. He's like, where you guys been? I didn't have anybody to nuzzle all bloody day. Okay. Also, our cooler's not working for some reason. Zone, build roof. Oh, shit. It's because they're backwards. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> oh, okay, well, now we're gonna need a bunch of... I do that every time. I have no idea how I get anywhere in this game. I'm gonna I'm gonna cancel all these mining orders. Cancel the outside ones. Just cancel all those and cancel all these and cancel these there. Alright, he's getting tended. Hopefully he doesn't have anything legitimate that we should use medicine on. A couple bruises, it's fine. All right, so they should mine this and then go mine up there. Your health, you're tended, you're rested, get to work, dude. And how are these animals doing? Spoils in 23 hours. Son of a bitch. Now we have to butcher all these animals. <laughs> what do we have? Four pigs and a turkey? I don't want to interrupt what's going on here, so I'm going to let it roll. So they started with the floors, which I should have turned off, but I didn't. All right, we just lost bird meat. I want you to come over here and finish the butchering before any of these things rot away. And let's take a second shot at this. Like a true amateur. Check and double check. We're good this time. So when they get some of the smoothing done, they have two days. Mind that out. I'm sick of looking at you. <laughs> there we go. Okay. I like how I blame them. All right, we're going to get one of them right away, so that's good. And we should have the power in the grid now. Nope, we would. I like that we don't have any pawns that won't do certain tasks. So because of the opening, it still doesn't matter. Not getting any colder. Man, I can't believe I did that. Well, they're all sleeping. I got to check the time as well here. Yeah, it's definitely break time. So cheers to the patrons, Alexander, Viking, Brandon, Cobra, Samurai, Corneal B, Dapper Go, Dirtle Dave, Thelburn, Frederick, Henry Wallace, Howard Chan, Josh Grace, Michael Rakestraw, Wake Mata, President Lux, Seamus, Shiggy, Tyronix, Typhios, Adam Bartnikowski, and Axum Yellow. You guys are all very, very awesome people, and I very much appreciate your support. Oh, this is dumb. Where is Alex? I'll see you guys next time.